I think that there is never any black and white, and I think that being an actor allows you an opportunity to opportunity to explore some of the dark sides of, of what you might want to explore, uh, especially and specifically if you're not like that. So, uh, you know, for me, it's been a real challenge to play this guy, to do nothing, very, very little, to, to say everything with my eyes and my body, to be listening more than speaking um, is a wonderful exercise for an actor. My favorite is the beginning that you see a man who is very meticulous and who is so very careful in the way he cooks his food, serves his customers, really does care. And that is something I think is absolutely brilliant. And then you find out that he is the big boss, walking around in a yellow shirt and a clip-on tie uh, and really politely saying, can I get you anything else? Uh, and then you find out that he is really the head of this incredible organization. So for me, that was a wonderful beginning, and it really was inspiring to, to have that as a through line of my character. Oh my goodness, I think uh, one of the finales that was really great was The Sopranos. Uh, I think is a wonderful one. Uh, the Wire, uh, some, some really great shows that historically I think will live on beyond their years. And, and certainly I think that Breaking Bad will equal that, knowing our writers and, and Vince Gilligan. Especially because when you have a show that, that you can see an end for, the fans can't, uh, the audience doesn't want that. But I think um, brilliant writing and truthful, honest writing <laughs> demands it. And uh, so I believe that this will go down uh, this next season as uh, one of the best finales around. I, I don't think so. I, I think especially this day and age where we're you know, so challenged uh, in our environment and economically and in a humanitarian way, we're also very challenged about what we would do to survive. And you have characters here who want to survive. And this is what I love about this show. It really isn't black and white. You find yourself one day thinking about things that are completely crazy that you would never think about doing. And that's the truth for most of us, or many of us, but we don't, we don't cross that line. And this is a show about people who do. So I think it's a brilliant investigation of, of uh, human need and want and desire. It's been one of the most special experiences of my career uh, to work with someone who, y you can tell when you walk on the set and everyone is, has a cohesive feeling uh, on the set, uh, not only in terms of actors not trying to outdo each other, but also in terms of crew members and everyone connected to the show, um, giving all of what they can in a polite way. It comes from the top, it comes from the man at the top. And that flows through everyone. So without giving him too many accolades, I can say that you know, when you have a leader who is humble and inclusive and uh, really is a team player, we all feel it. And it, so it's, it's been marvelous.